there is really amazing science coming out these days around sound and frequency. And I've been diving into that a lot over the last couple of years. Um, one of them that I find very interesting is the use of high frequency to grow bones from stem cells. And they're finding that this is the most efficient way to grow a bone from a stem cell. And if we know anything about stem cells, they're actually all the same cell, but they grow into different things depending on what they get cultured in, what they get put in. And so I think about this a lot when I do my work because I also study the science of water a lot as well and the way frequency and sound and vibration affect water, which is a whole different conversation, yeah. but that's a big one. And so yeah. what I see a lot in the body is the energetics of the plasma and the water cells, which is really the roots of our life in our body, rearranging and reorganizing. And when they do that, the cellular structure of our body can grow and change in any way that we could imagine, because that's literally how we change and grow cells. And it's like something that I've just been sort of piecing together with all these different amazing scientific studies that are being done on these things. But um, there's also a lot of science around Alzheimer's patients and um, the 40 frequency hertz, which has been studied um, to show that the 40 frequency hertz can either slow or stop the progression of Alzheimer's in patients. And that's because it's keeping the neurons connected because the frequency works with the neurons. And so I, there's all these really amazing things that we're seeing come out about the magic of frequency. And I see a lot of those things happening just intuitively when I work with people. Um, sometimes I'm working directly with the brain. Sometimes I'm working more with the cellular structure within the body. Um, it's a little different depending on every person's needs. Yeah. That is so fascinating. And I, I feel like science has barely scratched the surface of, of the power of frequency and sound. When you talk about water, I mean, I hope the listeners have seen these, whether you've seen the TikTok or just heard about like these water experiments where either they play different types of music to water and it crystallizes in different forms or speaking to water, right? Like positive things, negative things. I think it's both water and plants. I I, I forget, but I, I I've seen... Um, these experiments and just realizing that we are, there's a lot of water in our, in us, in our bodies. Like, like it, it makes sense that we would be affected by sound. Fully. Yeah. Fully. We're 99% yeah. molecularly water actually yeah. like in our bodies. Oh, wow. And, and the fact that I, I think it's empowering to hear you say we can change our bodies at, in whatever way that we want. 